I'm Kimberly Kay with your daily entertainment report. Kim Richards from the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills says she says her niece is to blame for the pit bull attack that left her hospitalized and she's not saying definitively that she's getting rid of her dog that has attacked four people. Kim claims she told Alexia to leave Kingsley alone in the bedroom but her niece Alexia entered anyway and that's when the pit bull went on the attack. Richard says the dog has gotten very protective recently because very few people visit and she's alone in the house most of the time. She says she gives everyone fair warning the dog should not be bothered. Now get this, Kim says, the second I realized Alexi had been bitten on the finger, leaving a puncture mark on her thumb, I immediately called my sister Kyle and took her to the nearest emergency room. We're told though that that puncture is actually a bite right down to the bone requiring two surgeries. After wandering around homeless, Amanda Bynes is in desperate straits with no place of her own to live. Amanda crashed on a sofa in the middle of the Beverly Center in Los Angeles. There are pictures of Amanda out like a light Thursday morning in the middle of the mega mall. It's incredibly sad. Amanda's parents are moving to Texas and ending their conservatorship over her because they're just not equipped to convince their daughter she needs meds and doctors so she can survive. Amanda was crashing with friends last week, but she's been wandering around the West Hollywood area with no place to go. She's been getting 50 to 100 bucks a day, but it's not enough for her to get a place of her own. And she's been complaining she doesn't have enough money for a hotel room overnight. Well, the parents, Michael Strahan hates to see her go, but he loves the look of 23 million dollars in the bank so he's finally ready to part with his most beloved and prized la area mansion tmz sports has learned the nfl hall of famer is pocket listing his brentwood pad which buyers have been drooling over ever since michael and nicole murphy broke up in august real estate sources say michael is emotionally attached to the 15 1,600 square foot palace he just bought in December for 16 million. But recently he'll decide to, he decided to let it go if and only if he gets an offer of 23 million or more. The spread includes nine bedrooms and 14 baths, but not Nicole. We're told she moved out back last summer. That's your latest entertainment news. I'm Kimberly Kay.